They say travel leaves you speechless and then turns you into a storyteller. And if there's one country that proves this, it's France, without a second thought. If you're curious about what's so special that the country has in store for you, then the answer is pretty straightforward. An enchanting blend of natural and fabricated beauty. Let's admit, getting to explore France is nothing less than a dream come true. From climbing the Eiffel Tower and exploring landmark museums to just wandering on the charm coastlines, France really has it all for adventures. It's no surprise that millions of people flock here each year. The more you see France, the more you fall for it. Being the cherry on top, it's home to some of the most beautiful cities in the world, with Paris being the first on the list. And with that comes some fantastic hotels to stay, restaurants to treat your taste buds, and a lot to explore. Does that have you wondering what it'd be like to finally hit the exquisite roads of France? We bet! But with so much to drool over, what do you begin with? Hang in there, this video covers it all. Get ready to live it up! Best Cities to Visit in France Marseille On the list of all the wonderful cities of France that are waiting to be explored, we simply can't get over Marseille. Or let's call it home to a perfect mix of people and cultures. Seems like the primary attractions are calling out all the travel enthusiasts out there. Just a quick glance at the attractions here will make you want to fit them all into your itinerary. Yep, Marseille is really home to some of the best museums, like La Ville Charité and Borley Castle, and spectacular locations like La Canabière. Everything is so vibrantly buzzing in action. With this super edgy vibe, Marseille is so full of luxurious hotels that it becomes quite a deal to finally decide on one. However, all of them have one thing in common, the sky-high comfort level. Our top recommendations are Maxi La Ciotat, AC Hotel Marseille Prado Villodrome, and A en Provence, all of which make your trip a total treat. When planning a trip to Marseille, another pressing question surrounds the time of the year that'll perfectly complement your trip. So let's not get this twisted. Hands down, the greatest time to visit Marseille is from September to November. That's when the beaches, attractions, and lodging are free for visitors who come during the high season. Or April might be it too, when visitors may find lower airfares and hotel rates coupled with pleasant weather. And while you catch up to Marseille's sun, don't forget to get stuck into the finest eateries there that are absolute treats to your tongue. Some of these are La Mercerie, Tuba Club, and La Mat. They know what it takes to get you licking your fingers. Not to forget, since most neighborhoods here are pedestrian-friendly and straightforward, walking is the best method to get around. Wait, you really gotta delve into the ancient culture there and unwind at the best spots to sink into the scenic beauty. That said, there's a list of don't to. Firstly, don't avoid exploring beyond the old port, and definitely don't underestimate the weather. Nantes This one's yet another city so full of wonders which will convince you that visiting France was the best decision you ever made. All thanks to the city's energetic vibe, the castles, and all the points that are enchanting to explore. When in Nantes, you don't want to miss out on Jardin des Plantes and Passage Pomeray. Also, you've got no reason not to explore and unwind with your loved ones at the premium hotels at Nantes. Yep, they feature all you ever need. Some of the highest standard hotels there include Le Talon Sac, Le Squeeze, and Hotel Voltaire Opera. Yep, you won't regret booking with them. Wondering how to get around in Nantes? Frankly, look no further than buses and trams, and for the locations, we recommend using Google Maps. This is the finest solution that'll get you almost anywhere in the city, so you get to explore it all. Considering that Nantes has a marine west coast climate, it's quite simple to tell the best time of year to explore the wonders of the city. For us, it's definitely the months from April to September when there's little chance you'd experience anything inconvenient. When on the go, especially in a city as fine as Nantes, nothing's ever complete without fine dining. We recommend going to Artenbloom, Estate, Patisserie, and Vacarme. 
three of the restaurants no one has ever said anything bad about. Planning a trip to Nantes already? Don't hesitate to try out their cuisines and check out their industrial sector. You're gonna love that. A bit of sacrifice is always needed, so make sure you're never starting your conversation in English there. Paris Paris is definitely a must-visit city in France. Let's call it the city with a never-ending array of stuff to explore and do. Once you visit there, you wouldn't want life any other way. That's a bet. Known for some of the most iconic structures in the world, it shouldn't come as a surprise that Paris tops the list for us. With charming boulevards, stunning structures, and views like the Eiffel Tower and the sparkling Sacre Coeur rising into the heavens, there are good chances you'd give up anything for a tour of Paris, wouldn't you? Onto the true bounty of why this city attracts the world so much, the answer is simpler than you think – the extravagance of their hotels. If we were to name some of the hotels that have garnered super high praise from travelers, these include Hotel Bellamy, Prince de Gaulle's, and Hotel de Berry. As you would have guessed already, the perks of staying here are insane. And here's another thing – every month of traveling in Paris comes with its own perks. But for starters, September and October are the greatest times. That's because these months bring pleasant weather, Paris Fashion Week, and changing foliage along the city's most beautiful gardens, which you wouldn't want to miss out on. When it comes to food, again, Paris is spot on. Among some legendary food spots in Paris are Le Fouquet, Le Poule au Pot, and Double Dragon. And if you take our word for it, no trip to Paris would be complete without tasting the delicacies here. For the best part, getting around town is absolutely no hassle. Use the Paris Metro, and you'll quickly get to wherever in Paris you want. Yep, the RER Express train is connected to the 16 interconnecting lines of the subterranean system, all to make it easier for you. Traveling to Paris soon? It's natural to get anxious about the do's and don'ts there. Among the do's, we definitely recommend taking your sweet time, absorbing Paris's culture, and before all else, going to the catacombs. With that said, don't rely on your credit cards and don't believe the rumors there. Don't all these fabulous cities with mind-boggling features make you want to book your trip to France? There's little chance they don't. We're truly in awe of all there is to discover out there, while we just hop around knowing nothing about all that awaits us in the country of wonders. Which city would you love to travel to? Do let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel if you're an avid traveler. We do everything to make your travels worth your time. See you in the next video. Goodbye!